night. It's like 6 a.m. So I'm excited to just get on this plane, pass out, get back over to the States. It'll be great. But the, uh, the Europe tour was crazy. It was so good. We got Asia tour next. Nikki, why? Are, oh my gosh, are you in the airport? You probably are. So good to see you. So good to see you too. Jade! Hope you're well. Uh, how's your day? It's been, uh, it, not very eventful so far. We just woke up after like an hour of sleep and came to the airport. Did you have fun? Yes, the Europe tour was crazy. It was like sold out every single night, basically. I mean, it's like, I don't know. Sometimes I have to like, I don't know. Sometimes I have to take a step back and just be like, holy crap, we actually get to do this every day. And, it, and it's crazy. But um, I'm ready to just go home and like, sleep for a while. <laughs> I'm so tired. Excuse me. Welcome back to LA. Well, we'll be pretty soon. We got a little promo to do, but then yeah. Oh, have you guys seen Dak and Brody? You are approaching. <laughs> we got any Dak and Brody fans in the house? <laughs> Where's episode three? It's coming. That for you is good. Thank you. I like that song. Or wait, it's not mad for you, it's mad. Can't stay mad. I prefer Dak. <laughs> I'm so tired. Uh, I don't know why I came on here, but I was bored walking through this airport. Hot, what's up guys? It's Dak. Um, so basically, I just left Birdie like back at the uh, hotel and I'm at the airport now and uh, it's pretty pretty awesome now because uh, Birdie's not here. Uh, <laughs> just kidding. Just kidding. I literally slept one hour. Yeah, same, Nikki. <sighs> Want more cliff content? All right. We have other cameos coming up too. So be ready for that. There's like no one in this airport right now. It's so strange. Have you had your coffee already? See, no, because I want to get on the plane and fall right to sleep. And if I drink coffee, I won't be able to do that. How's life? Life is good. Life is so good. Um, it's been touring nonstop. I'm like excited to just like have a couple days and chill and like drink some coffee and write some music. It would be nice to get back into the writing mode. Although Daniel and I did write a song yesterday that, or I guess we kind of wrote it this morning, like really late last night, early this morning. But it, it's definitely a cool idea. Um, 
yeah, so excited to get back to writing and chilling in LA for a sec. This is a long walk to the gate. I'm glad that I didn't like dilly dally. For the rest of the guys, um, well, I had to use the bathroom, so I went in the bathroom, came out, couldn't find anyone, so I just walked to the gate, and that's what I'm doing now. And then I was like, I'll be bored if I just do that alone, so I might as well go on Instagram, you know. Oh, Malaysia. I love Malaysia. I'm excited to go to Malaysia. Yes, I made it. Okay. Alright, I got, I'm getting to the gate. <sighs> Finally. You look so good in that hat. Thank you. Awesome. I hope you enjoy it. Show in Frankfurt was so amazing. That was a good show. Who inspires you the most? Hmm. You know, Ed Sheeran is very, very inspirational. How long is the flight? Probably like eight or nine hours. I don't even know. I'm gonna just fall asleep and then hopefully I wake up when we're landing. That's the goal. Good question. So, this is a question for all the Dak and Brody fans out there. Um, but episode three, there's a scene where, if you don't, if you if you remember from the first episode, Dak is very against eating meat. So there's a scene where something goes down, and, it, and he gets served something that has meat in it, and he isn't very happy about that. Um, Dak also has a sibling, which is pretty funny, and there's, like, this whole thing that goes down with his sibling, and, um, yeah, I don't want to give everything away, though. <coughs> I think we have a couple more episodes filmed, like, we have, like, two more episodes filmed, they're just not all the way, like, edited and everything. Do you like uh, Louis' new song? I haven't heard it yet, if I'm being honest, but um, I'll have to give it a listen. Mm, baby, I just can't stay mad at you. Mm, 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 mm. I can't stop listening to that song, seriously. Like, it's just kind of vibey, you know? In the morning when we wake up, through another fake breakup. Don't even remember what we were fighting for. Why is it dead in that airport? Literally, so dead. So liven it up a bit in here. Throw a little party or something. Imagine they just had like nightclubs and airports. It'd be kind of fresh. Although I think a lot more people might uh, end up missing their flight, which wouldn't be good. Pose for a screenshot. <laughs> um. Scandinavian Airlines departure to Stockholm, flight number one five three zero. Final call. 
Not me. What's the lowest note you get? Uh, <laughs> That's probably the lowest. I have kind of a low voice. I always forget that and then it comes out. That sounded like a burp. Thanks. How's the life go? Um, pretty good. I'm a little tired right now. Excited to get on this plane so I can sleep. I'm crying in between the girls Standing back inside the sheet James Charles on here He's watching this? No Not possible Did you like Europe? Yes Love Europe it's so beautiful, and the people are so good over here, and the history is so cool, just walking around, and like, I don't know. I love the architecture, and I can just feel, it feels good. Y'all gotta figure it out in Europe. Going to Logan Paul's boxing match. I don't think, I think I'll, I'll, I'll I can't talk. I think I'll already be in Asia. Don't even remember what you find. Jason, what's up, man? Uh, I was asking, where are you now? I am in London, heading back to the States, finally. <laughs> I'm gonna go drink coffee and sleep in that airport now. Nice. Yeah, I'm in the London. London Airport. Jason, I have to send you some songs, bro. We've been we've been working on some stuff. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to United 123 service to Washington here at gate B32. Not me. So please take a seat in the gate area, and we will let you know once we are ready for boarding. Thank you. need the British accent. Not very much. No way, you're actually moving, Jason? That's amazing. We can actually hang out now. I need to get my ping pong game up. Uh, are you doing a pop-up shop in Australia? That'd be cool. I doubt it, but... Are you alone? Uh, I'm not, but I went into the bathroom, and when I came out of the bathroom, couldn't find anyone, so I just figured I'd go to the gate, and then I'd be where I need to be. Yeah, Jason, I'll uh, send you something. How tired are you? I'm very tired. We had our show last night in London, and then all hung out a little bit back at, uh, at the hotel, and then went to sleep for like an hour, and then had to be up at 4.30 to come here. So, your fedora is glued to your head. I know... Whatever. I just like it. Are you going to stagecoach? <laughs> yeah, I'd fit in well with this. Did you enjoy Norway? It was really cool to be there. It was. I have to say. I like this one. This is actually cool. Um, 
Can you please tell Zach and Corbin to start a Cliff and Shab show? <laughs> That'd be awesome. What are you doing for Halloween? I don't know yet. I feel like I should figure that out. And I have, like, no time to do that. Gabby! What's good? Hope you're doing well. I think I'm seeing you soon, Gabby. Anyways, I don't feel like I have much more to talk about, but I hope you guys are doing well. And I'm excited to sleep, to be honest. And uh, yeah, I love you. Thanks for such a great Europe tour, if you're watching this from Europe. I know it's kind of early, but thanks for the best tour. And um, yeah, it's such a crazy thing that we get to do that every night. But thank you. Alright, love you guys. Have a good one. And uh, keep streaming mad at you. Alright. Bye! Oh, and what am I too? Can't forget about it.